So question number three says, what is the range of the function shown at the right? So you have to get your y axis because it's on the right. Um, so this is, x could be your independent and y could be your dependent. Or this is the main and this one is range. So you have to just get the axis. So negative 7 goes with negative 1. Negative 2 goes with negative 4. 0 goes with negative 1. 5 goes with negative 9. And since they're repeated, you only count it once. So it's 9, 4, and 1. And B is your answer.